Here are the differences between how hybrids, plug-in hybrids, and electric vehicles work. Gas-powered cars are straightforward. You fuel up at the pump and you just drive the car. A hybrid powertrain works similarly. It's powered by gasoline, but the car also contains a small electric motor with a separate hybrid battery. The hybrid battery charges as you drive, and the vehicle switches between using the engine or electricity to get you around. A plug-in hybrid works this way too, except with one big difference. The battery and electric motor are much larger, and it can be plugged into an outlet at home. This means you get some of the benefits of all electric driving, like zero tailpipe emissions, for around 30 or 40 miles. Once that larger hybrid battery runs out, the car behaves much like a regular hybrid. The benefit here, depending on how much you drive daily, you might use little to no gasoline for shorter trips. Electric vehicles don't rely on gas at all, and instead have one huge battery. EVs tend to accelerate quicker and require less maintenance than other types of powertrains. But most electric vehicles have a driving range of about 250 to 300 miles, which is relatively short compared to hybrid and gas cars. With a dedicated home charger, you can recharge your EV at home, but keep in mind there are also far fewer places to charge an EV while you're out on the road. They can take an hour or more to fully charge, so longer trips require more planning than when you're traveling in a gas, hybrid, or plug-in hybrid vehicle. But not all EVs, hybrids, and plug-in hybrids are created equal. Regardless of what you choose, check our ratings for exclusive test results on models with each of these powertrain types.